In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily silence all notifications except for one person. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes and of course do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys! So let's get started and uh, first off head over to settings and then tap at focus. That's where we need to create a brand new focus mode. To do that, tap at this plus sign and then select custom. Then first off you can name that focus mode. I'm just gonna name it one person. And after that you will be able to select uh, color of uh, that icon and also the icon for uh, that focus mode. I'm just gonna pick um, that one. Then you can hit add next and then customize focus. That will bring you to uh, that page where you can choose people for which you want to enable the notifications. So I'm just gonna hit add choose people and then first off make sure that allow notifications from is checkmarked and then hit add plus sign and then just uh, search for uh, some user in that way. You can also checkmark multiple users at the same time and once you've done with that just hit add done. On the next step make sure that choose calls to allow is uh, turned to allow people only and then hit add done. On the next step hit add choose apps and then on that step you need to uncheck mark all those apps just like that and then hit add done. And now as you can see in the app section it says non allowed. So when this focus mode is enabled we'll get calls and notifications from just uh, that particular person we have selected. And if we want to activate that focus mode we can just uh, from the home screen swipe down from the top right corner to bring up the control center. As you can see now do not disturb focus mode is activated. I can turn that off and then if you want to select uh, some specific focus mode you can just uh, hold down your finger where it says focus that will show you all your focus modes and then we can just select one person to activate that focus mode. Now you can write down in the comments below if you have any questions about the tutorial. Hit the like button if you like that video and I'll see you in the next one.